Tony Visconti, Woody Woodmansey are in the studio right now. Woody. Yeah. Um, do you remember Hammersmith Odeon? I do. <laughs> yes, infamously. You so say you heard about what I used to get up to? Oh, no, what? After the first show, I went in there and stole a bunch of your gear. You didn't? I did. Did you? What did you steal? Well, I'm, I'm making an amends to you right now. Oh, yeah, good. Is that what the water is? No. Oh, OK. And I think I think I took a couple of your mics. What I did was... <laughs> no, not mics, cymbals. Did Sorry. you really? Did, you didn't know that? No, I didn't know so that. So someone must have... Were they your drums? Yeah. How much... I, I need to make amends to you. How much was a couple of cymbals? Um, 150,000. <laughs> <laughs> Get out of that one. Now that's amends. <laughs> a couple of the top ones. Really? I, I, I nicked them and I got I got the bass player's son, Am, I believe it was a son. Yeah, it Am. was. It was a son. Yeah. But... Who, who really, who really, who really took the brunt of it was it whoever was recording it, all them Neumann mics. Who was yeah. recording it? Was um, it BBC or something? Yeah, the BBC were there, and probably Robin Mayhew as well. Our sound man was running it through the desk. How but did you manage to do that? Because I knew that place like the back of my hand. I, oh. I was from Hammersmith. Yeah, and I was like the uh, Phantom of the Opera in that place. Oh wow! <laughs> and uh, they did two nights. Don't get me wrong, I was a massive. Bowie Spiders fan. Yeah. And if I really liked you, I'd nick some gear off you. Oh, that's a compliment then. I'll take it as a compliment. <laughs> and, and It's a British thing, right? I, for, well, for me, it was. If I like you, I steal from you. I like um, that. I like that. After, after, after the first uh, night, I, so I came back there. I saw the show. I came back about two in the morning. They had some bloke in the third row. Like All the gear was still set up. I didn't know what anything was mics or anything i didn't know anything yeah all i just knew is that i got to have some of this stuff because <coughs> i was a massive fan yeah and i snuck in there i knew a way to get in there i had a minivan that i nicked i pulled it up around the side i got in there i waited for this bloke to fall a kit in like the third row he was catching flies so and i sneaked sneaked on that's when i got a couple of symbols the sun amp the mic got bowie's mic with his lipstick on this li little electro voice yeah I can't believe you don't know about it. No, that. I didn't know. Yeah. But, uh, <laughs> I know, you know, some gear went missing through the tours and whatever, but I never knew quite yeah. where and what went missing. Yeah. So how much... Amazing. What can I do to make it right? How much is a couple of symbols? <laughs> I'm serious. Back then, probably, I don't know. How much do you want for a couple of symbols right now? Oh, $10. No, for real. For real? Yeah. Ooh, I don't know, $100. For the two? Yeah. I'll give you 100 bucks each. That's cool. I'll have that. Is that good? Yeah. Okay. Wow. I like, I like, I like this, this kind really of going trade down. and it's good. I this thought is actually I was... happening, folks. I can report this from my seat. I always There's thought I was 100, a salesman. 200. He peeled off 200 Look at from that. his wallet. Sorry. Thank you very much. I'm not, don't take it personally. I was just doing it because I was a massive fan. That's cool, man. Oh, my gosh. I thought I'd never see that. <laughs> That's true, man. I have immense. $200. You're a gent. Yeah, and I was thinking about that all, day, all, all night to, to do that, you know? Yeah. Cleaning up my act. Was that the one that was filmed by Pennebaker? That yes. Yeah, yes, so I, I mixed that album, and we were missing cymbal mics and cymbals. <laughs> <laughs> Look at his face yeah, Go now. easy. Go easy. <laughs> one <Yeah>. a day. <laughs> I don't remember. Let's, uh, what, we we play music? Sure. Let's play, uh, this is your band. Was it after, straight after, you boat? Yeah, about maybe a couple of years after. I'd done the Spiders thing with Trevor on bass, and we put a band together, did an album, and toured a little bit, and then um, decided to put my own band together, basically. Who so, was the singer? A guy called Phil Murray from Newcastle. Yeah. And... Um, did, yeah. you, did you have fun? Was it kind of weird doing it after being in the Spiders for so long? It was very weird. It was... Um, You're not going to top the Spiders. Well, you've always got that in your mind. Yeah. Do you know what I mean? Um, you kind of got that as a yardstick to judge it against. I think I and saw... And it's very it. hard to get near that. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. To I be honest. I think, <laughs> I think I saw you at the Marquee. Did you? Did yeah, you we actually, the marquee? yeah, we actually got a residency there. Uh, yeah. to, which, which was nobody else got a residency. I don't actually know how we got one, but yeah. we did. It's good. Good job you didn't do two nights in a row there. I would have had your symbols. <laughs> <laughs> well, let's let's play this. Uh, this is U Boat. 
And it's called U Boat, right? Yeah. And uh, we're here with Tony Visconti, Woody Wooden, and Z. They're playing tonight at the Wilton as Holy Holy, where they do all Bowie covers. Should be good fun. Um, take it away.